All right, this, this was kind of special. This, this was kind of special. This is a movie that we've been waiting for for a long fucking time. Motherfucker was, was on my head. Wait, where's the review? I thought it was day one. I'm like, I was in Japan. All right, calm down. I was in Japan. <laughs> they, had, they, they will kill you. Because... I had to fly back from Japan, which I didn't want to do, but I had, I had to see this movie. So we saw, we saw, we just, we just got back. Spoiled free in the beginning. There's a lot to go into. What are your thoughts? Um, emotions ran extremely high for a nigga while watching this yeah, movie. Yeah, for a lot of reasons. For a lot for of reasons. a lot of reasons. And they, uh, the way, I just, I really enjoyed the way that they, they set it up. Yeah. They allowed you to have this emotional connection, but the movie itself was not overpowered by the sad and memory of, what you know what I'm saying? They didn't yeah. make, I, re- I have a lot of respect for the, the actors and the directors for having the strength to do this shit, yeah. man. They, this movie dealt with a lot of emotion. And we'll get into that in the, in the, in the spoiler section. But right right now, it, it, it dealt with some heavy themes. And obviously, you have the, 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 the main thing, which is Chadwick Boseman, rest in peace to him. He's not in it. And... and Somehow the movie is still able to like stay on two feet even without him, and and they 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 don't shy away from it. They let you know like he's gone. It's just fucking us up right now. And they they let you know, and it fucks you up too. They're fucked up. You're fucked up. And you know what I mean, it's it's one of those things where it's like you're all in the same headspace and you feel the loss, but you still got to move on. This movie is 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 kind of about moving on, and still handling stuff. Man. Like right, right out the gate, and I really, I really appreciate how they did it because they, they, they show respect to him. I know some people was like, "Oh, just recast them." No, 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 you don't recast the child of. Now that's that's what you want to do. That's not what's best for the story. Like, and 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 in his memory, like he, he, you don't do that. You you find a way to continue, right? Now I know some people. You know, people are up in arms right now. They calling everything under un, under the sun woke and blah blah blah. And I know some people are probably gonna say the same shit about this because people are man babies now. And then anytime anything is different than when they what they want it to be, then they get on the fucking pedestal and start bitching. And I know it's gonna be the same thing with a lot of things in this. And it's really fucking annoying because like you you it, it's detracting. It's taken away from from. Certain things that are trying to you know do things positive to positively, and then they they have an issue with this, and they think it's an agenda, and it's like Jesus Christ, can we enjoy shit? For the love of God, can we enjoy shit? Like yo, they too focused on this. I want this. Ah, uh, anyway, 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 what I'm trying to say is I really enjoyed the movie. Like a lot, a lot of things in this you can tell are a step up from from part one. Part one, I've seen I've seen part one in the theater at least sixteen times. And it's like the first time, it's like, oh shit, second time, oh shit. The more you see it, the more you start seeing, okay, the CG's not really the best. It doesn't take away from the movie. It doesn't take away from the movie. But, you know, the more you see it, the more you start to see, you know, the cracks in, in, in the CG and all that. Like, okay, it's a little rough, but, you know, still enjoy the movie. This one, you can, you can already tell the CG's way, way better. Like, and you're doing underwater shit. You're doing, you're doing battles here and there. And, 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 and you, you, you can already tell, like, okay, all right, this, this, this is on point. Speaking of the... No, no, not speaking up the CGI. This movie, to me, made sure it wasn't mass. It, it, you know, I, I saw less CGI, more fighting, hand to hand combat shit was realistic, and that that really pulled me in. I mean, I saw I saw a lot of CG. I mean, it's got it, it, it was, mean, it was. Know, it's, it's a Marvel movie. It's Black Panther. You know what I mean? So, and because of like the, the water scenes, I get it. There was yeah. a lot of CGI, but okay there there was a lot of cgi but to me it had way more hand-to-hand combat and they showed the power it, the- it was a lot of fighting yo it was a lot, a lot of, fighting. of fighting and, and i just want to appreciate the underwater stuff like the underwater stuff it was almost on some avatar shit you know what i mean like underwater it was a whole it it, it was a whole kingdom under there like they go on they like oh 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 like i mean it's not just you know yeah we got this little spot right here now it's the whole joint it's the whole joint Namor also yeah, was <laughs> a worthy adversary because like I, I I like I like where they're going now because now they 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 show a villain, they show you his motivations, and whether you agree with it or you don't, you understand why they're doing what they're doing. Mm-hmm. It's like they're not like, I want to rule the world. Why? Because fuck it. No, it's not that. 
It's like, I want to do this because this, 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 and this, and that can happen. And I got to make sure this happens. So. And I got to protect this. So y'all get rid of that. Yeah. So before I come up there and smack. And do that. You know what I mean? It's, you, (laughs) you get it. (laughs) You, you. You <laughs> and the actual, actual conversation in, in the deleted scenes. <laughs> if you want to sit there, <laughs> like you, you, you get it though. You know what I mean, like you understand why, why he's doing what he's doing, and, and you know where he comes from. Like he, and he, he, he gives you the be the, the the backstory, and it's 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 not like a whole thing randomly. Like oh, here's my backstory. It's like you, it's 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 for a reason, and he, he gives the backstory for a reason. You know what I mean? To explain certain things. And and I like that. I appreciate that. And you want to say like, oh, shit. OK. All right. That's, that's fucked up. You know what I mean? So. I, I really appreciate how they handled this character. Now, I know his <laughs> origins and this is different than, you know, in the comic stuff. And that, that's going to happen. It's, 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 you know, I mean, you got to live with it or you. Well, that you, ain't or you don't. me because I didn't really know much about his character. So I went to the movie just enjoying the motherfucker. Right. Right. At the moment. Right. It's like they. They handled the character in a way that serviced the movie for me because like they set him up as like, all right, this is what he, this is, this is what he wants to do. This is why he's doing what he wants to do. If he stand in his way, she's going to get fucked up. Yeah. Look, that's a, he was a strong, look, I don't want that feather feet motherfucker coming towards me. She's going to get fucked up. Asking about who he is. So fuck that. So we uh, this is another movie we saw with Jade. Shout out to Jade, and and her and I were talking after the movie, and 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 one thing that we appreciate is like the fact that in this movie everybody got they they chance to shine too. You know what I mean? Nobody really got skipped over. Everybody had their moment. Like you know what I mean? Everybody brought something to the table. You know what I mean? And and everybody played their role in 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 what needed to be done. We we got introduced to Ironheart, who. A little bit of like criticism. Mm. Um, I enjoyed her character, right? I did. Some some of the dialogue with her was a little too heavy handed and cringe. Yo, sis, we gonna do this? Where my super suit? Like, let's get, let's get it pop, let's B. Get it pop. You know what I mean? You heard? Like it's like she was still lovable, she's right? Tone it down a little bit. I like the character. Though. She seems yeah. adorable. She she definitely brought it. She definitely brought it. I didn't. I did not dislike her. It's just some of her dialogue was like, eh, I could do without that. You know what I mean? It's a nitpick. Maybe people, other people didn't feel that way. Or maybe they do. You know, maybe it's half and half. I don't know. But I feel like her dialogue could have been improved a little bit because she, she, you know, she was obviously kind of the comedy relief. And some of it worked. Some of it didn't. You know what I mean? It didn't take me out of the movie. It's just, it, some of it was like, eh, eh. You it, know what I mean? It, it didn't destroy shit. But I will tell you one thing. As far as her background, her story, you would need she would need her own storytelling TV show or or movie. To, oh yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. So I, I would like the, her. I would like them to dive into that because, like, I mean, you see the the, the, the Tony Stark inspiration, right? Yeah, you see it, and that's mm-hmm. that's where she gets that love. Like she idolized Tony Stark, and you know I mean, and she, she was like a a, a a child prodigy built, built. I think. At fifteen, she fucking built the shit. No, four years. She said at three or four years old, she started to push it. Yeah, together. build build things together. But the actual suit oh, and yeah, all yeah. that, like I think she was like fifteen when she built it. Like and yeah, like you 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 see how she got that shit working, and she she's a genius. She's yeah, on. She's like on some. It, it makes sense that her her and Shuri would be like friends. Hell yeah, they're you know what I mean? The same shit. Like 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 they got they got that 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 mind, and they was over there like conversing and and, and comparing notes and shit. And I love to see it. That's why I say I love the character. It's just some of her dialogue was just eh, but not all of it. Not all. When 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 they were doing the tech talk, I'm like yeah 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 yeah. I'm following along. I got notes and shit. I can't build shit, but you know what I mean. I can watch. You know what I mean, and repeat the shit. No, nah, fuck that. I saw you put a desk together. If you can put together a desk, you could do the same shit as them. I mean, the desk don't fly. I push a button and it goes up and down. It could if I throw that motherfucker out the window. And then you pay for it. This movie was fucking great on so many different levels. Mbaku. Had had a bigger role in this joint, and this motherfucker is hilarious. He was one of my best. He was one of my favorite characters in part one. That we will not have it. That that shit. I still run that line to this day. And in this one, he he had some one liners, yo. You bald headed demon. He had some one liners. He had some jokes, but he also had some real shit too. He wasn't all jokes. 
Mm-hmm. He had some real shit to say when he, when when because he saw the situation and when he had to drop real shit. He said real shit. And I'm like, mm-hmm. damn, this is a, this is a dope character. And it fucked me up that he had to. I, yo, that's that's when I had a breakdown. I had that emotional breakdown in the theater because he was like, look. Oh, no spoilers. No, no, I'm, I'm just saying like verbally he would say things like he, he, he wasn't joking. He wasn't right. laughing. He was serious. And I said, damn, you a real, you a real motherfucker. Yeah, yeah he you. was a real dude then. You're like he was dude. a real dude. Like he said, you saw even his face, his demeanor changed and because he, he saw when he had to be serious. Like it's such a dope character, man. And he had a bigger chance to shine this mother, but everybody did. Okoye, everybody, like everybody had 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 their moment, and everybody brought it. Everybody did their thing. Everybody was a badass, man. Shuri, you 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 oh, are a fucking yes. G. Yes, the actress that plays Shuri, like you are a G. I want to meet you in real life and just just you know what I mean, just dap it up, whatever like that. Because I loved her in this fucking movie. I fucking loved her in this movie. Like the shit she, the shit she had to deal with and everything. Her give her a fucking award. Angela Bassett. Give her a fucking, fucking award, award because Give her she the first award. fucking killed it. Do you know what she I love? Killed it. Um, people. Um, I need. I needed people to read in between the lines of this film. I want people to understand what made the character, the character in this film. Emotions, man, played a major part with Shuri in this movie. Yo, man, like we we gonna wrap up the spoiler free section because I want to get into some spoilers. If y'all on the fence, I don't know why the fuck you would be. Go see this movie. You know what I mean? There, there's, there's some people. I, I've seen some things online where people complaining about certain things. Of course, I don't pay any attention movie? to that. Yeah. I don't pay any attention to that until I see the fucking film. And I've seen the film. I love the film. I, I, I had a really good time. I enjoyed what they did. And I will, I will be seeing it again. I'm going to wait a little bit because there's some emotion attached to this joint that I'm not ready to go through again. But I, I really want to see it again. Any last words? Oh, um, much respect. Mm-hmm. Much, much respect. With that being said, we're going to end the spoiler-free section, getting some spoilers <laughs> in three, two, one. They start this joint off with, 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 with the passing, right? They, they started off and they, 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 like, they waste no time getting into it. And you see how stressed out Shuri is. And she, she, she's counting down and she's trying to save her brother's life because she's got this illness. Which is kind of like mirroring real life, you know what I mean? And she and she's trying to save him, and 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 in the middle of trying to you know recreate the artificial uh, uh, the herb the heart. Mama come in is like he's gone, and then immediate funeral. When I tell you they did the fucking Marvel logo, oh. and it was it was, a, oh. I couldn't do it. I couldn't do it. That shit killed me. I, I couldn't do it, man. I knew I knew it was bad because um I knew it was bad for you because I had reached over to grab, you know, the, the stack of napkins that we bought. And for a specific reason. And when I reached over and I saw that you had used every last napkin from the concession stand, I realized you were going through it. No, I, I couldn't, man. Cause it was silent too. Yeah, quiet, quiet. It was oh like God. there was no music, no nothing, which is like the perfect way to handle it. Cause it's a sad moment. And you gotta, you know, you pay respect to it. It was all quiet and all I'm like, nah, I can't do this. And it hurt. It fuck. It hurt. So, so with the pain that we felt, they had beautiful there was beautiful imagery. They had the best moments of him. Yeah. And I think I started to cry a little bit more when I realized. That damn, I really fell in love with him as the character yeah. in Civil War. And life just really doesn't prepare you for certain shit. It's crazy how you 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 can feel connected to somebody you don't even know. No. I've never met know. this man a day in my life. I've seen him as an actor in a lot of things. I've enjoyed him as an actor. And somehow I felt like emotionally connected to this individual to the point where his passing hurt me on, on, on such a level where even when I think about it, I just get sad. Like... Like I knew him, it, it, it's, it's weird to think about. But you that's, were in L.A. when he passed. Yeah, um, I remember I was trying. Yeah, to, nah, I'm not getting it. That shit hurt. But Ooh. it. I know L.A. was probably quiet for like an hour. Oh it? man. But yeah, they 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 do that, and the whole movie like they're 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 showing everybody dealing with this loss. Like Angela Bassett, 
like for first at the at the at the uh, the UN when everybody say like yeah what's up with the what's up the vibranium you supposed to share that shit with us like w- what's going on it's like yeah we in France we can use the shit like what's up and she's like nah bitch fuck all that because some motherfuckers tried to roll up in here and take the shit. And we beat them the fuck up. And that shit was crazy. Because them niggas came in with the guns. Like, where, where's it at? Like, oh, oh, it's over there. Yep. A- Open it. Okay, okay. Open it. <laughs> whoop, 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 yep. whoop, whoop, whoop. Next thing you know, they in court. <laughs> whoop, 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 whoop. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you thought, motherfucker. You and thought. Angela Bassett displayed pure strength in yeah, this movie. Yeah, she's like, these motherfuckers right here, mm-hmm. here you go. You're welcome. Stay the fuck off our lawn. If you, if you, if you step the wrong way, you can get fucked up. Yep. Peace, bitch. It's like, we've we already lost things. We don't need to deal with this shit right now. It's like, we got bigger things to, 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 to do. You know what I mean? So, like, she, she's, she's, she's dealing with this, and Shuri's dealing with it. And Shuri, like, I feel so bad for her because, like, she goes through so much in this fucking movie, man. She goes through so much. My, like, my God, man. Like, even, even like, you know what I mean? Going up and, 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 and like, trying to get out of there and, and, and the chick trying to take her to, to meet Ironheart because, like, to feel like she needs to get out of here. Like she needs, she needs some, some, some air and all that. Cause she's, she's going through it. Cause even when, when the moms wanted her to, you know, burn the funeral guard, she's like, no, no, I don't want to do that. It's like, you, you, you believe that you know, his spirit is still here. Like, but he's gone. <laughs> you know what I mean? And I feel like that's how people really feel in real life. It's like, yeah, you got your way of dealing with it. Like you, 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 you feel them in the air and all that. And it's still with you, but they're gone. They're not here. That's how, that's, that's tricks. Your brain is playing on you to, 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 to you know what I mean? To comfort you. To cope and- like, that's not me. They, 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 he's gone. And then I'm like, fuck, man. Like, I've been in that same conversation. Like, and, and I'm, I'm like, I think that's why I like these movies so much, because they deal with loss in such a realistic way, like a human way. Like, the, difference, the different ways that human beings process the shit, right? Like, some people process it different. So the point, she doesn't even want to burn the funeral guard. It's like, dude, that's it. You know what I mean, at least I got this. You know what I mean? Or, That's what I took from it. I took that from. I, I felt as though she didn't want to burn it because she's still holding onto a yeah, piece. Yeah. So you're telling me to get rid of this? At that point, I really have to accept the fact that everything, you know, everything's just man. Yeah. And then she's talking about her anger. She's like wanting to burn, to burn the world. Like it is, it's not going to stop with that. Like I, I'm, if I burn now, I'm going to want to burn the whole entire world. That's when Namor shows up. Like yo, these motherfuckers. Or show him trying to get vibranium, cause uh, the child, you know, exposed it to the world and shit. Now these motherfuckers trying to trying to get the shit because they don't know that vibranium is, is in other places other than Wakanda. That's a, that's a revelation for them. So he's like, "Yo, you need to help help us handle this shit because uh, it's kind of y'all fault." So <laughs> here's a shell. Alert us when you get the scientists that made this machine that's that's tracking the vibranium. All right, peace. Hey man, say yo, y'all go kill her. Y'all go handle that. We all gonna see more of me and a bunch of a no, bunch no, of no, 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 not kill her. Y'all gonna deliver us to uh, the, her, deliver to, her us, to us, yeah, so, yeah. so we can kill her. So that that's that's when that whole thing starts, and they go over there and get her, and and she she's she's a fucking prodigy. She's a genius, damn near build building all these machines and all that. She didn't know what she was building for though, but she's just building. You know what I mean, and 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 making it happen, which leads to the fucking fight on the bridge with 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 the, with, with with Namor's goons. That fight was crazy because she was, yo, Okoye was going toe to toe, one on, like, one, one V5. Like, <laughs> yup. Damn. What was that joint called? Was it called Tekken Force? Where it was like, that, 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 that side scroller? The side scroller. Yeah, yo, yeah, yo, yeah, yo, yeah, yo. yeah. She, she, she handled her own, but she was shook when she saw that she used her best moves. And the motherfuckers got right back up. Yo, and I hope, I hope I'm getting her name right. Like, I, I think that was her name, but. <laughs> I'm, I might be a little foggy on that. And if I'm, if I'm saying her name wrong, she's going to fuck me up. So I hope that's her name. <laughs> you're going to be asleep tonight. Woo, woo, woo. And I'm going to have the bald head. Like, <laughs> whoa, whoa. <laughs> <laughs> so I hope I, I'm getting a name I'm right. Yeah, I'm going to have those name more, those name more wings on my feet. Like, nope. I see you flying out the window. <laughs> <laughs> like, shave his head too. <laughs> <laughs> you bald headed demon. <laughs> like, I'm out. So oh. I, I, hope, I hope I'm getting the name right. If, if, if not, I apologize. But yeah, she was going toe to toe with all of them, murked them, and they got right back up. You know what I mean? Like the the the, the fight, the fighting was, was 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 on point, and 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 she displayed being the ultimate badass in this one because like she she was she did so much fucking fighting, like I, I just really I really really enjoyed it, man. But like 
it, 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 when I look at how much loss Shuri had to go through in this movie, because mm. then even with the mom passing, mm. like that that was the that was the final straw. And and that's the scene I was talking to, like when when Mbaku came and and he was trying to, you know, console her in a way. And then she threw that line he said back in the first movie. <clears throat> like, like, like a child that scoffs at tradition. And she's like, oh, so now you're gonna listen to me? And he's like, like all, all, all the loss that you've experienced, I, I can't look at you as a child anymore. Like you, you, you've gone through loss that, that turns a child into an adult. Like that's some real shit that he said. It's like, I was like, fuck. Like he really see what happened is like, hey, you're not a child. You've gone through too much. You lost. That shit turns you to an adult. And he wasn't lying. And then she, she, her, her line is something to the, 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 the extent of like, I just lost the last person that, that knew me. That knew me. I was like, fuck, man. And, and that, that was the thing that really like, like, like sent her over the edge as, as it would anybody. Like you go through loss after loss after loss. It's like, it's going to change you, yo. That shit will change you. You're not going to be no pure hearted, smiling every day, motherfucker. That's, that's not, that's not, that's not real life. Um, unless, unless you, you, you're able to compartmentalize that shit so much. It's in the recesses of your mind, and you just or you just on autopilot, or or you're drugged up or something like they they, they don't work like that. Doesn't it? But then, and then you look at the motherfucker who caused the death of your mother. Yeah. So of course, war is on your mind. Re- revenge is on your mind. And I feel like the movie, the movie, made everything about Sherry realistic. Yeah. It wasn't over exaggerated. It didn't make her super like it, it. Everything was real. Honestly, in the middle of the movie, I thought that Sherry and Neymar would get together. Mm. I had it fucked up real quick. I said, "Hold up, are they connecting?" It, it, it was it was one t- it was one like a little little mm. section when you know when they when they you know were able to kid when they were about to kid the scientist and she you know showed up and was translating. It's like just, just take me, just don't hurt her. And they ended up taking both of them and all that. <laughs> but she went she went willingly. You know what I mean? And then he, they more were showing her around. And they put her in in the in the in the you know the special guard because like yeah you you know you a princess you know, where where this shit? Now you showing her around. Give it you know gave gave it a backstory. And that's where we understand where he's coming from and why he's doing what he wants to do because he's like, yeah, these motherfuckers are fucking shit up. And eventually they're going to come for us because they're not going to be satisfied. That, that, that vibranium shit, yeah. they want that. So they're, gonna, they're not going to stop until they get it. Eventually they're going to be a problem. So I want to take them up because I got people to protect. I got a whole kingdom over here that I got to look after. So I can't risk that shit. All mine, so. I can't risk it. So you know what I mean? Eventually get down to the like, y- y'all got to side with us to go against them. And, and she's like, listen, I can't let you kill the scientists and we can't go to war. Like that's not how we, how we do it. And it's like, they don't see eye to eye. Like he's trying to extend an olive branch, but his, his olive branch is insanity to her. Cause like, it's like, that's all our war. And it's like, that's not what we about. So, you know, the, the button heads are not seen eye to eye. And that's where, you know, the, 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 the rift happens. Cause it's like, nah, but d- during that time I did get, I, I got a slight little feeling like, are they connected on that level? But I'm like, nah, not really. I mean, he's just, he's explaining to her, <laughs> This is this. These are my people. This is why I have to protect. This is why y'all need to help us. Because if you don't, we're taking y'all down first. Like on some gangster shit. It's like, listen, you gonna be the first ones to fall. We got we got more here than you got. We we about this life, right? Because like you said, he blamed them for. So either them being either, <laughs> either you help us or you get fucked up. Which leads to you know what I mean when 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 Shuri and and, and the scientists get get rescued. And he finds out, then you have an extended warning shot where they're flooding the shit. They, they're, they're, they're murking motherfuckers. And Man. he's like, listen, bury your dead. We're going to come back in seven days. Run that. So. Oh, shout out to, um, I forgot. I don't, I don't know her name. I know her name is Lupita in real life, but shout out to the girl who was Child's Love in the first one mm-hmm. for finding Shuri. That was some 007 yeah. shit. That was, yeah, 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 so yeah, yeah. that was decent. I mean, she, she's decent. nice like that. She, she does, you know. She's female solid snake. Espionage is her thing. Like she knows how to how to how to like you know what I mean. You to come find me. <laughs> what you gonna do? She's a badass. She gonna slap you the fuck up ASAP. I change for her. I would I would truly change who I am for her. Man. She ain't even gotta look too hard. Well, yeah, there's always somebody who would change for you. I, I I get it. You still get slapped. No, I was still saying. <laughs> so when, when can I ask you a question? What if you? If you look at how, if you look at how the emotions ran high in this movie, mm. did the movie was the movie as good as it was to you 
because they allowed you to mourn while watching this movie? Because I feel like, you know, Chadwick Boseman has, he passed away, was it two years ago? I think so, yeah. I feel like I really started to mourn his loss more while watching this film. I think I started to let go and accept it. Because until I watched this movie, I tried to like tune it out. Because it hurt. Yeah, it's like this movie forced you to face it. So it's it almost it's, it's almost it. therapeutic in a way. It forced you to face it. Like you, 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 you can't you can't run from it. They put it right front and center. It's like, yeah, he's gone. They they let you know he's gone. And they and they're 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 doing multiple like 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 uh what was the word I'm looking for? Um they show you multiple times that, you know, they, they, they got these, these montages and all that where they, they, they really, they, 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 they don't let you shy away from it. They don't let you hide from it. They, it's front and center. This is a movie where you can't escape that. So, and I feel like that, that, need, that needs to be done as much as it hurts. But it, the movie's also able to stand on its own two feet without that, mm-hmm. too. So it's it's not it's not just a great movie because of that it's it's a lot of other things too, like especially with with with, with Shuri's transformation into Black Panther and and you know attempted to go to Astro Plane and then seeing Killmonger there still not giving a fuck. Yo, I forgot. White garb, all all New you know what I mean, dreads. all dressed up. You know what I mean, fresh fresh dreads. Like, yeah, what's up, cousin? Was that, good. Yo, that scene itself, that was some powerful. Yeah, shit. yeah, 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 yeah. Because yeah. that wasn't the person who I expected Shuri to see when she had. You know, I'm looking like you're gonna go see your mom. You're gonna see your brother or your pops. You mm-hmm. know, I'm thinking the visions were gonna be family. No, it was Killmonger. I mean, it's still family, but <laughs> it was still family, but the fucked up version, the fucked up. And, and the, the crazy thing is, they they have words. He's still aggressive. Still aggressive. And he's asking you, so so what you going? Who you gonna be? I mean, you are gonna be noble or you gonna handle business like I did? And then they cut it there, and she wakes up. And initially, you think that's when she woke up, but there was more to that, which which they show when she's actually fighting anymore. About how she's on the same tips, like yeah, I'm not, I'm not even a chance. I'm gonna kill that motherfucker, like damn, damn there. And and she goes on a rampage, yo, to the point where I'm like, yo, are one of these motherfuckers dying? Because they they're they're going at it. She they she found a way like like to with her and Ironheart like like collaborated to find a way how to you know weaken them so that they're doing that. And she they're, they're going toe to toe. He ends up impaling her with the fucking spear. You're like, oh shit, what's happening? And he's like, I need water. Like he he's struggling. And then, and then she thinks back to to the rest of the conversation with her and Killmonger, and she she flips in front of him, and she's destroying him and about to about to kill him, and I really thought that motherfucker was gonna die, like because it it was blind rage. I'm not really blind rage. It was rage justified because like he 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 killed the mother, yep. and and she's thinking about everything and she's about to go through with it because like she's dealt with so much loss at this point. She's like. I'm gonna kill this motherfucker now. Would it would it have helped her? No. Mm-mm. But at that point in time, you're not thinking about it. You're not thinking about what's the best way to handle this shit. You're like, I want justice now. You know what mm-hmm. I mean? I'm a human being, I want justice right now. Luckily, her mom was like, this ain't you. Show them who you really are. Show them, and, and and thank God that she showed up because if she didn't, this motherfucker would have had a vibranium spear <laughs> through the skull. Because she would have killed that motherfucker. She ripped one of his wings off. Yeah, 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 yeah. Like, oh, yo, yo, yo. That brutal. scene when she took off the wings off. I said, oh my brutal. god, brutal. Like they were going at it, yo. They were fighting, fighting. Meanwhile, the fucking army versus army on on the fucking ship on some gangster shit. The way mm-hmm. they showed up, but but the problem is both armors were gangster. Both, both of them, <laughs> highly skilled gangster. Not giving a fuck. They talking about we gonna take y'all out. Y'all gonna take us out. We, and these and. and what was scary about um, Namor's people was they were arriving on whales. Mm-hmm. I am afraid of whales. Orcas at that. They Muff look Buck, evil to me. Motherfuckers in there spinning and then tossing them yeah, up tossing on, them on the up. ship. Like they was ready, yo. They were they was they was ready. And they kinda had a home court advantage because they they, you know, in the middle of the ocean. Middle it's like ocean. so they're, they're, oh yeah, all right, cool. My middle, playground. And um Namor's um main goons. Remember there was the girl and mm-hmm. and, and, and the husky boy. Yeah. And like it just it just displayed the respect each each community had for their king, and I, I really enjoyed that. I think this movie really gave me it gave me life. Man, the emotions fucked me up. Yeah, man. Movie, man. Yeah. So luckily, they was able to you know come come to terms because if it wasn't for that, there'd have been some casualties. 
even more casualties because motherfuckers definitely died in that battle. So luckily they was able to do that. I know they were relieved when they said, hold up. We ain't gonna fight no more. Like, cool, 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 cool. Even the whale was like, oh, thank God. I've been swimming all motherfucking week. <laughs> Yo. Like, oh, man. And, 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 and then when, when Shuri finally, you know, realized she had to, you know, let go and, 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 and burn, you know, the funeral garb, and they, they did, they did. <sighs> ah, man. They did that montage. They showed, they showed scenes and, I was trying to flip my seat all the way back. It yeah. couldn't go back no more. I'm like, I, I have to tell you, nigga, your recliner ain't going. Yo, you was trying to go I was trying. Man, I was trying to break that seat. I'm like, I, I, I can't do this right now, cause like they, they, they pick the best scenes to hurt, to fuck you up the most, yeah. the most. When they showed him and her doing the handshake, oh, when they God, did the handshake, man. I started to break down, crying. It fucked me up. Fuck, man. Her finally letting go. And then how about when she met back up with um. I call her. I'm, I'm going to keep calling her Lupita. When she met back up with her at the end, and then that with, surprise with, with his son that that looked surprise. just like him. I'm not looking at Chris. I'm like, I'm like, is, is, is that his little brother or his real son or something like that? Because that nigga looked just like him. Here was motherfucker looks just like him. I'm like, okay, all right. So, and I'm wondering if them showing us his child opened up future doors for him to step in the suit one day. I mean, time will tell, but it could definitely be that because when that motherfucker grow up, yeah, yeah. So that's the way you don't have to recast the child because now he got a son. So when he grows up, there you go. Although Shuri made a great Black Panther though, because mm-hmm. she was on point. Suit was nice. Yeah, she she was on point. I know people gonna be complaining, oh that female Black Panther, even though it happened before. So. Hey, I don't, I don't, I don't understand, but you know, people are going to be crying woke and all that shit. So that's, that's the, 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 the word of the day. So they're going to keep using that shit. But anyway, I, I didn't have a problem with it because I, I fucking enjoyed it. I, I, I think she played that role perfectly and she, she dealt with that grief of the way a human being would. Cause like, it'll consume you when, when, when she was talking to M'Baku and, and got gangster with that shit. She got real gangster, like, listen, motherfucker, I'm going to take this motherfucker out, and you're going to help me, you're all right? Me. We leave tomorrow. He's like, ooh, ooh, ooh. <laughs> we like, will have it. <laughs> we will have it. Yo, she got gangster, because that it, it, it comes to a point where it's like, you deal with so much loss, it's like, nah, that's it. Nah, it's like, why are you talking about my mom like she's still here? She's gone. She's gone. I'm going to take this motherfucker out, and you going to help me. That speech, that, that, that when she said to Mbaku, really fucked me up, she said, those hopes... Those dreams, everything that she wanted is gone because she's no longer here. Yep. And it helped me understand that Shuri is no longer Shuri. Yeah. Blinded by grief. Ain't no way in hell. Ain't no way in hell you go through all that in one fucking movie. And, she and, was, and, and you're happy, go lucky. Nah, that's yeah. gonna fuck you up. It's like that's the that's my last connection. That's the last person that knew me. Taken out like this. And then Baku realized that he said, Yo, this ain't the way. He 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 didn't try to fight it though. After like after she said that shit, he's like I mean, because what you gonna do? You, you like this person is is is, go, is mourning right now. You can't say that you got to calm down. There's a better way. Like they don't want to hear that. They're not going to hear that. You know what I mean? Like like they they don't hear the words you're saying right now. They they see what they want to do, and that's it. You either with me or you against me. Yes, Which is the way I would be if I went through that. I'd be like, listen, you better line the fuck up because if you don't, that's your ass too. Shit. It is what it is. And there, there, there is a lot of rebuilding that needs to be done in Wakanda because mm-hmm. that shit was shattered. Yeah, that main man said, "I'll be back in seven days." He came back in seven days. Like, if this this wasn't a movie. If this was a movie that dealt with a lot of a lot of loss, a lot of emotion, like human emotion, like dealing dealing with things, processing things, being overwhelmed by by things that are gonna fuck your life up, and and finding a way to get past it. And you got Elaine fucking shit up again. Gosh, she... Got got Elaine fucking shit up again. I call her Elaine because of Seinfeld. That's her name now, Elaine. Elaine. And like, I, knew she, I knew she bugged the beads. I thought she was cool at first. Oh, fuck no. I thought she was cool. But in the back of my mind, I'm like, she's always up to something. She's always up to something. Like Ross can't even chill. Like he, he's trying his best to help. It's like, listen, I owe everything to Wakanda. They, they saved my life. Saved my life. They saved my life. So I got to ride with them. 
And she, she had hand, show up to his crib with the handcuffs. And like, what you, what you doing, man? Had him chained up like he's a fucking prisoner. Luck, luckily, he got broken out. Yep. Because he don't deserve that. So I guess he's going to reside in... I guess he's going to reside in Wakanda from now on. I don't he's, know. He's a fugitive now. I, I don't know. But 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 you got Elaine still, still building his team, so we'll see what happens with that. She's out here building the illegal A-team and shit. <laughs> Jesus. But with everything, everything said and done, I really enjoyed this movie. I, I knew it was going to be emotional. I knew I was going to cry in this film, and I, it got me multiple times where it's just my face was just glistening. And I'm like, <sighs> I'm looking left, I'm looking right. It's not helping. You try to take your whole head off. And yeah, back it's, it's like you, 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 you can't avoid it. They're gonna, they're gonna make you deal with it, and 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 they, they definitely did. Like, Damn, bro, just... my my tear ducts were, were 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 dehydrated by the end of the movie. You look like Neymar. <laughs> yeah, like for real, just glistening with no no ocean water. <laughs> But yeah, it, it was it was it was definitely it's definitely a movie worth watching in a theater. You have to see it in the theater for the full, full experience because this is definitely on point. I don't really want to compare it to the first one because like they're like two different movies for me. Okay, right? Because really like they 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 have a different feel. Like I, I really enjoyed Killmonger as a villain in in the first movie because the, once again you understood understood his motivations and his intentions what he was trying to do did he go did he take it too far yeah but you know you understand why and this one also you know Namor you 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 understand I liked him as a villain you understood what 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 he was trying to do and and how far he was willing to go when it comes to like battles this definitely has the edge because like this is straight up army versus army and him versus her and the fight scenes were way more like you know, crazy, but now if if the extra vibranium would, had never been discovered or walked upon, Namor would have never been a problem for anybody. Yeah, yeah. He if they, if, he's he's if they weren't actively looking for it. Yeah, he's he's at peace. He's not causing anybody any problems. That's why he hadn't been seen in so long. It's like they heard stories about him, but right. you know what I mean, it's like yeah, he's chilling until people poke they 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 knows where it don't belong, and then now. Now it's he like, can't chill no more. Like, all right, now, now it's game time. Now it's time to get fucked up. Now he coming out of the water with his hands up like, yo, 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 yo. yo. What's up? What's up? So <laughs> you understand. And that gangster he said at the very end, like that's setting shit up. Now I know that like for the most part, he, he's, 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 he's not a villain. So the way, the way they have him talking is like, it's kind of like villainous, but I don't think it will be. I think when when push comes to shove, it's gonna be some like you know he's gonna step up and help and, and group up with people and and you know build this alliance because like right now he's like yeah so they're gonna come for Wakanda Wakanda gonna come to us they're gonna need us we they gonna need us so you know what I mean we got we got we gonna have the power then yeah I, I was trying to dissect that last conversation because I didn't know he. I didn't know if he wanted to sound like a villain during that conversation or if he was saying, look, this is a good alliance to have, but they will need, you know, it, he, it was. He was trying to put his shorty's mind at ease because she's like, 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 I thought that we was in this together. Yeah, you, you bowing it up. He's like, no, 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 no. Listen, listen, listen. This, 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 this shit is planned, right? Like, they, they going to need us. So we, 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 we good. <laughs> we'll see what happens from here on out. But, um. Yeah, I'm looking forward to seeing these characters. I want I want them to do more with Ironheart because like there there's there's a lot there that they could that they could do. I don't know if she's um I think she's getting like a series or a movie, if I remember correctly. Which is good because I do want to see more of the character. Just just tone down that dialogue though. The, the dialogue just needs to be, you know, tweaked a little bit and then she'll be fine. Like she wasn't she wasn't all, you know, you know, wild, but some of that shit was, was a little a little a little, a little too much. Yo, I got my own show. Watch that shit, yo. You know who could have played um, Ironheart to me? Who? Um, Kiki Palmer. No. You don't think so? For no. some reason, no, I no, feel no, like no. Kiki Palmer would have no, no, no. crushed that shit. Nothing against Kiki Palmer. I, I, no, no. Let, 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 let's. No, no. She did. A, she did a great job. She did a fine job. Oh, you say, hell yeah, hell yeah. I'm gonna she keep did. Her. A, she did a fine job. Let, let, let's just keep her. Just, just tweak, tweak the, the dialogue. Because Kiki Palmer would have done the same thing. Exactly. <laughs> like, yeah, yeah, yeah boy. <laughs> Yo, you got, you got feathers with your shit. 
That's sick, son. <laughs> Shit, son. Let's go. <laughs> All right. You want that? No. Oh, whatever. Nothing I'm against cheap. Kiki Palmer. Nothing against yeah, Kiki Palmer. I'm, cool. I'm right. just saying. This actress, I'm not familiar with her. She did a great job. It's just some of the dialogue. I can't blame her for the dialogue. Because the dialogue was written for I her. I don't know how you know old mean? she is in real life. Because I couldn't. You know, she looked like she looked like a teenager in the movie. But yeah. then in the face, she looks like she could also be like 25 or 24 in real life. I mean, it's possible. Some it's people possible. just look really young. But she's good for the part. Yeah, she she's got that. She, she got that energy though. She got the energy, so she she did a good job. Either way, movie was me. I can't even fucking talk. Movie was dope. We'll be seeing it again after some time because I need them emotions to calm down before I. I don't want to go to the start crying again, even though it's gonna happen. I need to, you know, there needs to be a buffer in between that. But either way, we we saw the movie about you know day three because I was in Japan. So hopefully everybody can calm down because we did the review, and I loved it. And shout out to Rihanna for the beautiful song at the end. Definitely. And cut. Like I said, like she's like she gonna be watching the video. <laughs> Hope she see you think shit. Rihanna gonna see like, this? Like she gonna tag me saying, yo, good looking up the show. Shout out, B. <laughs> you think Rihanna gonna see this shit, son? <laughs> Spon- shoot- Sponsored by. <laughs> trying to shoot your shot. <laughs> she's taken, nigga. Taken? <laughs> she's had a whole baby. Yeah, she, she's super taken. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> Nigga, nigga ran to the microphone. <laughs> oh, Rihanna, Rihanna. <laughs> Rihanna, thank you. Thank you for the song. Nigga. <laughs> she ain't gonna watch this video. I heard the Kanye West joint. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> yeah. I don't mean to rock you, but. <laughs> you made sure to get that part out. Sponsored by. <laughs> Sponsored by. What's up, Rihanna? <laughs> 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 oh, you see fuck. this shit, nigga? <laughs> yeah. You see this shit, nigga? She ain't gonna see this shit, nigga? I don't know you. She, she ain't on YouTube. She got better things to do. <laughs> she ain't watching these. Right. 